Hi, this is Nick from Square Kicker, and today I'm going to show you how to change the font, style, and color of a single word on Squarespace with Square Kicker. So the first thing I'm going to do is open up my Squarespace site with Square Kicker installed, and I'm going to hover over a text block. Now within this text block, I have a couple things going on. I first have an H1 text. This is this entire line here, and I have an H2. So when I open up Square Kicker, I can see in my tools here. This is on Fluid Engine head into my font and I have all my different font types here. So if I hover over, I'll see the yellow outline surrounding my text that I'm on. So this is the H1 text and if I see here, this is the H2 text. So I'm gonna change my H1, so I'm gonna click into that. Now I can see a couple different things. I have all my text and I can also change the individual elements with inside of that. So this is the bold, the italic, the links, and even a strike through. So if I wanna change an individual word, I wanna make something bold first. I'm gonna do that and head over to here and make this bold. Now, as I head back into here, I can see if I change this, the size, I'm just changing the size of just this one element, which is the bold. And I could do something cool to it, like change the font size or even change the font family. And I might even wanna change the color. I can set this up as a template, maybe making a preset, and anytime I use this text block, I know that anytime I have an H1 bold text, it's gonna have this font type with this color. That's pretty cool. Now, we can also set up other subtypes as well. So we can head into here, and let's type in, make this one italicized. So this, this italicized one here, I want it to be my H1 text, and choose my italicized. And then I head down to remove italic, because I don't actually really want it to be italic. I actually just want to use this as a trigger to make a different font type. So I'm going to make this a different color and let's choose something that's a bit more punchy. There we go. And that's the color there. And now I want to do something different to it. So maybe I want to also add a highlight color. So let's just add a bit of a highlight color here and let's just make it a bit on the transparent side and I can bring the height up a bit. I can even do a bit of an underline there, but I'm just going to be a bit of a highlight there. Cool. So that's my italicized trigger now, is now a different color with a highlight. Lastly, I'll show you a different one, which is, uh, let's just use a strike through, because that's another one we can use. And in, in using that, we'll head it to strike through. Again, we're on my H1 font, and also we're on the strike through, which is this guy here. You can see it actually lit up when you hover over the different elements. So there's the bold, there's the italic, and then there's the strike through. So I can remove the strike through here, and now I'm free to make whatever different font type, style, family that I want to with this new unique strike through. And now I'm gonna make an outline color. So I'm gonna click on my outline color and I click on purple. And let's give a bit more of a border around that font there. That's too much. Somewhere about the middle, let's do two pixels. And what I can do is I can leave this text white or which is the default text or I can change it to a different color altogether. And if I want to make it even transparent, I can actually drag the color I have right to transparent and I get that really nice kind of outlined font shape there. Now what's cool is now I can head into my presets. Let's just call it my custom font, hit enter. Cool, so now that I have that, I can turn it on and off. Obviously it looks real funny. But then I can go to any other font types and assign that and it will carry right the way through. Cool, and that's how you change an individual word on Squarespace with Square Kicker using no code. Make sure you hit subscribe to get a heads up when we release our new Square Kicker tutorials.